Welcome back to Poke Central, everyone. In this video, I am going to be saying my top 10 favorite Pokemon. So before I start this video, I'm gonna let you guys know that I'm starting a new kind of challenge that every video I'm gonna be adding a new Pokemon plushie in the background behind me, and it's, you'll be able to see it, so it won't be behind me. But yeah, so comment down below if you could see it. Poliwag is gonna be there every video. It's not that Pikachu up there and not the Pokeballs. So it's somewhere in the background. See if you can find it, comment down below, and let's get right into this. All right, guys, at number 10, we have Beedrill. Beedrill is very special to me because it was my first ever Mega that I had in a game, and it's my favorite Mega by far because it looks really cool. I don't want to explain these too much because I don't want the video to get that long, so that's all for Beedrill. Let's go to number nine. All right, number nine is Zekrom. I chose Zekrom because Zekrom was my first legendary that I've ever gotten in a game because Pokemon Black and White were my first games ever. And I pulled a gold Zekrom out of a legendary treasures pack. So I'll show you the picture right up here. As you can see, it looks really cool. And that's the reason why I chose Zekrom. Coming in at number eight, we have Tentacruel. Most people don't really like Tentacruel and Tentacruel. But I personally do it because Tentacle is my very first shiny that I've found without trying. I was just surfing in HeartGold and I ran into a shiny Tentacle. I still have it right now and it will be in one of my shiny videos later on in my channel. So I really hope you guys did enjoy number 8. Here is number 7. Alright guys, coming in at number 7, we have Sableye. Now Sableye was one of my old icons for my YouTube channel. Um, it was called Slouching Sableye, and that channel changed, like, its name three times out of the whole entire time. And with Slouching Sableye, I got 24 subscribers, which was the most subscribers I've ever gotten before. Um, so that's really special to me, and I think Sableye being my icon, a lot of people like Sableye, so they just subscribed, I guess. So... Number six is up next. Number six, we have Chespin, Quilladin, and Chestnut. So Chestnut is just a beast with with its spiky shield. Um, Quilladin is just like a round furball, I guess, coughed up by a Litten, I guess, I don't know. But Chespin, we have a big story behind this, me and my cousins. Um, so we were, so me and my cousin like Chespin, and then my other cous cousin, likes Froakie, and I don't really like Froakies, but they're, they're okay now, I kind of like them, but anyway, about Froakies and Chessmans, we were having this whole kind of war on which starter was better, and we were all roasting each other's starter, I guess, and at the time, me and my cousin that liked Chessman, we didn't really know that we were roasting ourselves, but we called Chessman Cheese Pin, so that's kind of stupid on us, but anyway, the Chespins won that battle against the Froakies. And we are going to number five. All right, number five is Darkrai. The reason why I chose Darkrai is because that was my first ever level 100 shiny from a GTS trade. Always like Darkrai's. I have a Darkrai EX and a full art Darkrai EX. Well, you will see in my favorite top 10 EXs video. So let's go to number four. Number four goes to Umbreon. Umbreon is my favorite evolution, and it's most people's favorite too, because Umbreon is just like a beast and it's shiny form, just, it looks amazing. So here's a picture of its shiny form right now. It looks sick. Um, if you guys don't, if you guys haven't ordered one, order one now, because I have a Umbreon plush, it's not shiny. I'll show you it right now. This is my Umbreon plush right here. And it's going to be in the next top 10 video, so watch out for it in the background. But anyway, we are going to number three already. Number three goes to Trico, Grobile, and Sceptile. Not Skeptile. So behind this goes to that, you know, Mega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire when they first came out. Um, I got my Sceptile to level like 59, and that was my highest level Pokemon in the game. And I wanted to restart Omega Ruby, because I had both. 
But I was on Alpha Sapphire and I didn't know then. And then I restarted Alpha Sapphire with my level 59 Sceptile. So I got really mad and I restarted both of those games. But now my Sceptile is level 89, so that's very good. So let's go to number two. Number two is Snivy, Servine, and Superior. Most people don't like Gen 5 Pokemon, but I personally do because I grew up playing Gen 5. It was my first Pokemon game, um, as I've said before in this video, and Snivy was the first Pokemon that I've ever picked in a game, and Superior was my first Pokemon that I've ever gotten to level 100 without any rare candies. Number one goes to Poliwag, Poliwhirl, and Politoed. That didn't take a brain to think of because, obviously, if Poliwag is my mascot, who else would be number one if it hasn't been on the whole list? So, that was pretty obvious. Um, Poliwags are amazing. They're my best friend. I would never harm one. Um, yeah. So, that that's a wrap to this top 10 video. My very first top 10 video ever. If you guys did enjoy this, please leave a like, comment, subscribe, share. All that good stuff. Don't forget to smash that like button. And yeah, see you guys in the next top 10 video. Peace out.